All right. Uh, every six months, we need to do an oil change on the roughing pump for the uh, turbo pump system. Uh, similar to a car, you need to change the oil periodically within the pump. We have it uh, currently on a six-month schedule. Uh, the manufacturer recommends every four to six months. So every July and every January, I will, uh, I will shut the system down to change the oil of the pump. So I already have this going here, and you can see the oil coming out of the pump. It's got a slight uh, gray hue to it. In fact, uh, we see black spots coming out with uh, this latter parts of the oil. This is just uh, dirty parts of the pump uh, internally. You gotta remember, this is running 24-7, uh, so sometimes the oil starts leaking and this could cause issues with the pump and cause it to shut down. Other times, uh, we just have to periodically clear out the crap because it's a mechanical system and the oil helps it uh, maintain a longer lifetime but nothing lasts forever. So what you do is uh, you shut down the vacuum system and I'll have a different video about how to do that safely. And what I did, you can do this in place uh, beneath the table where the uh, high vacuum system set up, or uh, like I did, I, I carried it out to this table so I could more easily uh, direct the flow using gravity. So you set it up like this, there's a little spigot here on the end. So you attach a hose uh, and a little collection bin like I have down there, open it and on this side, I set up several wood blocks so that uh, gravity can further do some of its work and help relieve the oil. So the step after this is once, uh, once all the oil seems to have been uh, removed from the pump, I'll uh, pull the crank here. In fact, this will make the oil come out a little bit quicker. And as you, as you pull the hose, uh, this will help expel the oil from the internal parts of the pump that are in this reservoir. So you have the oil in the reservoir, and you have the oil that's still in the pump mechanism, so that helps get this out. So what you do after that is you take about a cup of fresh oil, and you place it into the pump, uh, you close this valve again, and then you, again, grab the belt and uh, position it through, or motion it throughout the, uh, the the pump internals and do this for about five minutes empty that and if it's still dirty in fact as i was doing that we saw more of the darkly color oil come out so if you still see that put in another cup and uh do this progressively to see if it'll get uh more and more clean uh if, if you're going through a lot of oil with this you can take some of the used oil that doesn't have a lot of crap in it and use that to help uh clear it out too but besides that, uh, it, it, you may not get it uh, perfectly clear because this is an older pump and uh, we have taken it apart periodically. There's nothing inside that's terribly wrong. But anyway, uh, yeah, continue that, uh, fill the pump back up, and then uh, start the system back up.